Who doesn't love Rovers? He's clearly very friendly in his own stalagmite kind of way. And this is the Roper I'm going to paint. But first and foremost, I've got to do my stream intro. So hello, everybody. I'm Jen Gagney uh, from Pixelscapes.com. Uh, I'm currently drawing and painting my way through the Dungeons & Dragons Monster Manual. Uh, and before I get going today, uh, I want to say thank you to Erica Regan, founding member of my Conspiracy of Evil. So thank you, Erica. Now, what have I got for you today? I have a roper. So let's watch the video of me drawing this fella. They like living in caves. They look like they're part of caves. And after that, it's just a question of tendrils going everywhere. Excellent. So they won't really be all those different colors. Um, that's just so I could tell them apart while I was doing them. So let's see, what am I doing? What's a good cave color? Purple? Blue? I do a lot of purple. I like it. It's tricky. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see, tendrils. All right. So I need those all to be separate for now. Um, and then, let's see. Do that, did I, did I? Oh, okay. Well, this will be great. So I'll get started without the tendrils in there. And that will make my life easier. I can remove my no-fly zone. Okay. So first things first, I want to do my... The colors on this fine fellow. And I might as well do the edit. And then what color do I want? I'm really thinking of blue. I like blue a lot. And select modify. Contract. 20. I don't know if this will work, but let's see. Is it like a freaky, a freaky glow? I'm a big fan of freaky glows. Yeah. All right. And then I do want a little bit of that on the. Up here, that I'm gonna paint. Oh, don't paint it quite that bright. I'm gonna paint it like. And then I'm gonna do more just around the middle of the. Okay, so there's the blue. And then, um, face colors. Because, like everything, gotta have it. The teeth. Teeth first. Sparkling white teeth, because there's lots of excellent dentistry in the Underdark. Uh, 
entspannen. And then here, I don't know if it'll be, I don't know what the background's going to be. So I'm going to make this pink. I can always change it. It's going to be heavily shaded anyway. Okay, so it really looks purple. And then the inside of the mouth here will be black, I guess. But with the glow. A little bit of glow. Um, even less of glow. Just like that. Okay. And then the eye. I kind of like this blue glow it's got going on here. Um, and then I'll give that a... I don't usually go for a central glow, but I think I'm gonna in this. And then I'm getting to put a little green in. Even more radioactive. I might change it later. I don't know. Okay, and uh, I'm really so happy to see you. <laughs> okay, now I need to figure out what color my background's going to be because that's going to be part of the tricky aspect here. Um, let's get don't sample all right. So what's kitty corner from blue? I guess green, I'll use green, and then red, I'm going to do, I think I'll make this red, and then I'll make it. And I'm going to make you go toward purple. And then the background. Hmm. Hmm. Not sure about this. I think I'll make it more yellow. And then I'll make the
Uh, let me try again. 100. Hmm. I guess it's okay. I'm definitely going to end up changing it by. Um, all right. Uh, let's see. Where's my tendrils? So, blue. And then the third set of tendrils also be hmm. Oh, I see. Oh, that's going to be tricky. Well, I will deal with it later. Um, I didn't realize I'd done that, uh, but it'll be fine. Uh, let's see. So now I need... Okay. Thirty and fifty. We'll see how that goes. Hmm. Nope, nope, nope. Um, okay, so let's try again. Fifty. Mm. I guess it's okay. I'll give this the same try. Nope.
and then the tendrils of rage. Okay. Now, it's got a lot of problems. <laughs> uh, oh, okay. X is the real question. Um, I mean, I like it. It's very monochrome. I can make the ends of the tendrils a different color. But I don't like either of those. Do it like that. Okay. I don't like it though. Uh, I'm gonna leave it alone. Um. It just needs black on the bottom edge of each. No. Hey, HPG. He says, I've seen enough anime to know where this is going. <laughs> yeah, there, it has that problem all over tech. I'm, I'm going to have to fix that later. That's what I was saying earlier when I was like, oh, this has a lot of problems. All right. At least the, co the contour works. But I need to get my lines. Okay, and the easiest way for me to see it is to actually do this. So select load selection, good, and then I'm gonna start stuff. Okay. A hard eraser. Uh, set at a hundred percent. All right. So see, it just kind of has it all over. Not cool with it. There we go. Anywhere 
else I want to write? All right, I guess that's it. Okay. Now I can make my stalagmite lines back to dark. Oh, did I do too much? Hmm. Guess it'll be okay. Oh, don't feel good about it. Oh. Now, I do have a cave texture. I guess I could. Maybe I don't have it anymore. Use my ripple lines, though. They're fun. Looking at Chad here. It's a holiday. I agree. It would be sweet if Roll20 could do animated tokens. And yay for going to the gym. All right. Yay. There's an animated gen for you. Okay. Uh, and then I think I'll do the same thing on the outside. I want to go that way because if I do, then it's close to the blue. Because that way, as I cycle through other layers, yeah, that's fine. Um, hmm. Maybe I don't like it. I'm going to go back a little. just so it's not quite so sharp. Oh. Okay. Be complicated. But I do like it. Oh wait, there's yet more erasing I need to do. It's all... Uh... on here. Whoops.
And then these lines. I don't want their. Did I do it as a? Nope. It's okay there. All right. Um. All right. Time to make this black. Ooh. Gives it a more smoky, mysterious look because it fades in. All right. Uh, let's see. Do I want to color lines? I'm going to make the outside. Well, there's so many options for this. Uh, I guess I'll make it magenta. I'll do it up near the top. And then I'll do, do it down. Seems a little... And then uh, for the B, I'm going to, uh, let's see. There's blue. And then, so I like the mouth, the purple tone, the eye though, I, I'm, or actually cycle through. Purple. pop a little. I don't know about this. I don't even really like the shading. Uh, let me, let me redo that. Face lines. What color do I not have here? Orange. I have a little bit of orange in the background. Um, I think I'll use pink and purple. I don't know. Go oh, picky. Hmm.
I am dissatisfied. I'm leaving it at that. Okay. blue around the edges of the mouth. Do I like it? I think I do. Okay. And Roper is done. So, thank you for coming by. Um, stick around after the Patreon credits, and I'm going to paint one more thing, I think. What am I painting next? A dragon turtle. Ooh. Okay. Uh, so, Patreon credits. Thank you again to Erica Regan and my conspiracy of evil, uh, as well as my other Patreon backers. Um, Tech Dragon and Hit People Guy are here in the chat room. Hi guys, thank you so much. Uh, and my new backer, Terminally Nerdy. Soul. And uh, come back after I'm done and we will uh, get another painting. Stay tuned. Or go watch a different video if you're not watching this live. Later. <laughs>